Many countries across Asia and the Pacific have shown incredible resilience in the fight against COVID-19. While some gradually overcame the pandemic's challenges, others found their capacities and resources pushed to the limit. The poorest and most vulnerable were left behind. ADB, Japan, the People's Republic of China, and the Republic of Korea tapped the power of civil society to help change this situation. Through the project, mitigating the impact of COVID-19 through community-led interventions. Ten civil society organizations in seven countries were empowered to lead activities that mitigate the impact of COVID-19 and prevent further spread of the virus. The CSOs focus on vulnerable and marginalized communities that governments find hard to reach. 170 communities in Armenia, Cambodia, the Cook Islands, Mongolia, the Philippines, and Thailand are now benefiting from this project. To fight against COVID-19 and its effects, mobile phones and computers were provided to communities for faster information dissemination. Telehealth services were strengthened. And domestic violence hotline and counseling services were established. Trainings on alternative livelihood programs were provided in Cambodia, Lao PDR, Mongolia, the Philippines, and Thailand to help those who lost their jobs because of the pandemic. In Mongolia, 33 communities have undergone entrepreneurship and COVID-19 prevention training, which specifically targeted female-headed households, elderly people, and persons with disabilities. In the Cook Islands, 31 communities have set up distribution points for hand wash and personal protection equipment or PPEs. In the Philippines, four island municipalities are raising awareness on COVID-19 prevention, contingency, and preparedness. More communities are set to follow in their footsteps, thanks to the power of partnerships. ADB, Japan, the People's Republic of China, and the Republic of Korea. Tapping the power of communities in the fight against COVID-19 and poverty.